Hi, welcome to Sass of Sabrina. This is the channel where I try one new thing a week and post however it turns out. I hope to inspire you to try something new or make you laugh through however my process turns out. I post a new video every Tuesday. Please subscribe, it would mean the world to me. So today I'm making a DIY jewelry holder or it's gonna be like a wall mount hanging thing where you just like hang your, in my case, costume jewelry on it. I have to admit I had one that was personally made for me. So beautiful. However, it was the person's only woodworking project that they ever made and I, I, I just felt like they needed to have it. And it's several months later and my jewelry is just piled up in a big heap on my dresser and I just really need to dust and I just really need to organize my life. So I have scrounged around the house. So I have wire, I have lo lots of leather actually, which for a bunch of projects I wanna make. I found a dowel, I found this, which I think it's gonna hang this way and I found some hooks. So I wanna put the dowel on the hooks near the top and those will be for like bracelets. And then down here, somehow figure out how I want to hang the necklaces. I don't want it to be just hooks drill, like put into the wood and then the, and then that's it. I want it to be a little bit more unique and, and artistic and, and fancier than that. Um, however, the dowel will be just these hooks on each end of it and then I can put the bracelets up from there. My first step is actually the, everything's really dusty. I'm gonna clean it all first and then I'm gonna start like playing around and seeing what I can do. Okay, how to make something level when the wood is not Oh, this is tricky. I'm not gonna use the level. I'm literally just gonna eyeball it, which is stupid. Yes, I know. Ah. Okay, so I literally just went and gathered up more. I have a ton like it would be a pile of like different hooks and s hooks and curtain hooks that i have i've got like two different types of these three different types of those two different types a poop ton and a poop ton of different types and more of these just like all of this stuff i don't know i don't know what i'm doing i'm playing and we'll just see what i come up with i do have more of these hooks and i do have more doweling so the necklaces obviously will be jingle jangling down here bracelets Bracelets aren't that long. I don't know. I wish they made like really pretty decorative hooks. I literally just woke up and was like, yep, this is what I'm doing. Yep, this is what I got. Yep, yep, yep. And then started rolling the camera. <laughs> so I just feel unprepared and I think I just need to regroup for a few minutes. Um, so in the end, it is just gonna be a bunch of hooks along the bottom anyway. Yeah, no, that is not what I want. I am doing this video very last minute and I do not want to run to the store for more supplies. I don't want it to be too busy looking anyway because it'll have all of the jewelry pieces hanging from it. So I'm just gonna screw those in place. I have no idea where. Nine, 10, 11. Okay, I have my spacing all figured out, width-wise, anyway, not height-wise, so it's gonna... I still need to tighten that. It's, so it's just gonna be trying to figure out where I want them to be placed on the wood now. So off camera, I'm just going to start screwing these in because that's not hard and probably and nothing will probably happen. So I will, oh, I say that in the wood splits right off the hop. Probably should be pre-drilling. The wood is splitting on me. It's also very old and very dried out. It's totally not a straight line. <laughs> 
that's okay. Let's see how much of a non-straight line it is. Oh, just a couple are off. Nice, not too horrible. Okay, so next, on my wall where this is gonna hang, I actually still have the screws from hanging the other ones still in place. On the back, I am just going to take these canvas or picture hanging items that I just happen to have around the house. Basically the two screws are gonna sit about here and here, but I'm just gonna extend this the full length, put these little eye hooks on the ends. So here we go. Let's see how crooked it is. How much of a monster it is. Not horrible. I don't mind that. All my stuff is literally just right here. That makes me feel so super short. I literally need to go on my tippy toes to, to reach that. I'm gonna keep adding my jewelry. Those are the ones my daughter made for me. And then I have like a huge pile that's probably all going to come out and fall on the floor. Maybe now that I can see them again, I'll wear them. That actually turned out really good. I have like some extra room and it's not hideous looking. Awesome. I love it. Thank you so much for watching my video.